Today I'm here to talk to you about first tee jitters. We all tend to get first tee jitters because there's so many people watching us when we're getting ready to tee off and such. So I thought I would give you some ways to kind of calm your body down before you actually have to stand on the first tee and execute the hit. What I like to do on the way over to the golf course is when I'm driving, I like to try to visualize myself playing the golf course. I like to visualize who I may be paired with for that day. I might visualize that there might be people standing on the tee watching me and me hitting this perfect drive, but it's good to be able to get yourself to visualize what you're gonna be experiencing. So use that car ride time as a time to kind of get into a visual state for yourself. It'll help calm you down for when you actually have to physically execute the shot when you're on the first tee. When you actually are getting on the first tee then, what you can do is make sure that you're breathing properly. A lot of times people will hold their breath when they're about to do the activity because they're the most stressed. So one of the things that I like to do is actually calm myself down by taking in a breath out of breath and then swinging. Another thing that you can do is just warm yourself up. If you don't have an opportunity to hit balls, you can actually just swing the golf club. Swinging the golf club helps you relax your swing muscles. It's not a time to get it absolutely perfect, but you're just trying to get your body in sync. And lastly, when you're standing up on that first tee, it's important that you go through your practice routine leading up to the hit. And you want to make sure when you're going through your practice routine that you're actually creating a really good picture for yourself. So you want to see what you want to do with the shot instead of trying to screw up in front of people. So try to paint a really clear picture for yourself of what you want to do before you execute the shot. So I'm going to hit this ball in the middle of the fairway, for example. That's a good visual for yourself to make sure that you're creating this positive sense about what you're about to do. Most people that actually screw up the shot are trying not to screw up the shot. And if you can talk positively to yourself, it actually gives you the self-confidence to be able to execute the shot. So three things, visualize positive images for yourself, Go through your pre-shot routine so that you can calm yourself down with some practice swings. And then thirdly, make sure you breathe. Take a deep breath in, take a deep breath out, and that'll help calm your body down before it actually executes the shot.